yeah, so this was planned. This was planned. This was planned. This was planned. I'm just like, man, these cards gonna play, spirit gonna play, and Sam is speaking. Um, like I said, one of my magic tribers wanted to know about how he felt, Sam felt about Bobby Woman after his death, marrying his widow after three months of him being in the ground. Peace and blessings, everyone. I am finally back with part two of the Sam Cook reading. Now, you guys know with the first reading, I kind of left you guys in suspense a little bit, but I dropped hints, though, throughout that reading. Like, now, it doesn't take a rocket scientist to put together who I was talking about as far as who was involved in Sam's death, who set it up. But I did not name names, and I did that for a reason. But after I did that reading, you guys, I sat with it, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to go back and do a part two, and I'm going to say whatever I have to say, whatever spirit wants me to say, whatever Sam wants me to say, you know? Um, so first and foremost, before I get into it, like I said, it's for entertainment purposes only. Going forward in this reading, you guys are going to hear some things that, you know, you may have heard before or... Um, you know, may have seen on social media or whatever, and you may get just confirmations of some things that we've already heard. So spirit is going to confirm some things that we already know. Okay. Um, but anywho, so long story short, the person whom I was referring to in the first video who was involved was, is, Bobby Womack. That is who I feel. That is who uh, I am being shown. He had a lot to do with that setup on Sam Cook. Okay? That is what I'm feeling. That is what I'm getting. And a lot of you guys kind of guessed it right. Um, it was uh, also his wife. Uh, I would say she was like really involved, but she knew. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, she knew. She knew who was involved in it. She knew the reason why. And if you look at her, if you look at her, and if you can read energy very well, she was not really in mourning. To me, when I see her, and when um, I just meditate and look at her and just sense the energy, it's more of a woman who is scorned, a woman who is angry, a woman who is hurt, a woman who is in, what can I say, in vengeance mode. She's she's vengeful. She's she's tired. Now we all know that Sam was a womanizer. That is not a secret, okay? So imagine having a husband that's always cheating on you, always doing all kind of things to you. Y'all are distant and all of that. Depending on the person, whatever going on, a lot of people can develop animosity and anger, okay? So this is the mindset of Barbara. Okay, this is her mindset at the time. And then you have Bobby Womack who is talking to you who and he's telling you all the right things the things that you want to hear from your husband you're hearing from his friend because that's that's let's keep it real they were actual friends he was actually uh i believe don't hold me to it i think he was part of sam's uh record label or something they were like his protégés or something like the group that he was in so there was basically they worked for sam or sam was helping them with their music so um he was much younger than sam so he basically wanted to become sam cook he wanted everything sam had he wanted the fame that sam had he wanted you know to look like him he wanted to sing like him he even wanted to have this man's wife okay so it's so much deeper it's so much deeper than what's what meets the eye and the crazy part about it to me is why nobody has said anything about this like how can you not be close to them and like you don't have no inkling or a little bit suspense about bobby womack and their whole arrangement like that don't set up your antennas in any kind of way and say wait you get with my my, my friend's wife a few months after his death you're wearing his clothes to his funeral. This man wore Sam's 
clothes to Sam's funeral. How freaking crazy is that? How nobody said, wait, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And then, you know, back in the day, you know, they didn't have DNA testing. They didn't have a lot of technology that we have now. So, you know, it's like if he was involved, it was so easy for if, if you make the right moves that it's easy for them not to have proof if you're smart enough or you're connected with the right people, okay? But anywho, I'm going to pull cards and we're going to see if the cards um, show us uh, more details into that relationship, more about Bobby's involvement, okay? So, let's get to it. Okay, you guys, so I'm going to go ahead and ask the question directly. Did Bobby Womack have Sam Cook set up to be killed? All right, so let's find out. All right, Spirit. Please show us, did Bobby Womack set up Sam Cook to be killed? Did Bobby Womack set up Sam Cook to be killed? All right, y'all. Let's see what cards come up. All right, so from these first set of cards. Oh, let's see. Make sure you guys can see all the cards. You guys, from these set of cards, I'm seeing, I'm seeing the relationship between Bobby, um, Sam, and Barbara, which is represented in the Three of Cups, okay? Um, her um, also realizing and knowing that Sam Cook was like he was cheating on her he was partying he was having sex with different women and she was upset that she was alone raising his child um or children i'm not sure how many kids they had but raising their children okay this is what i'm getting from the first set of cards here so it's like you know barbara she was feeling some type of way okay she was feeling some type of way and she went to bobby womack okay that is represented here in the king of cups Okay, this is Bobby Womack. Okay, so she went to him, um, confiding in him. You know, she knew her intuition was on point. She knew that Sam was doing a lot of things. She knew that maybe Sam wasn't even really into the marriage like that anymore. That is what I'm feeling. I think she felt him slipping away. I don't think she really, you know, she kind of tolerated the cheating. But I think when she felt that he may have been considering um, leaving her, he became severely distant. And that is when she started looking to Bobby Womack to fill that void. Okay. We have the two of cups here. We got the queen of swords, king of wands and the wheel of fortune. So man, I don't know y'all. I think she actually knew from the beginning with the queen of swords, that's someone coming strong. That's someone like, look, uh-uh, I ain't taking no shit, I am tired. And also, we have the Two of Swords, okay? So, yes, this is my deceitful card here. The Two of Swords, like someone doing something behind your back. You see the wolf, the wolf is coming behind the woman, and you don't see them coming. She doesn't see him coming, okay? So, that represents Sam. Sam uh, not knowing that the wolf was coming. So, this is showing me the setup. Like, I feel that is showing me the setup between Bobby and Barbara. This shit is crazy. All for um, his his money. They wanted his money. Um, they wanted... Uh, they wanted a life without Sam there. They wanted Sam's life without him there, of course. So, especially for Bobby. Bobby wanted Sam's life. We got the will of fortune. He wanted his fame. He wanted his fortune. He wanted everything. They felt like Sam deserved 
what he was going to get. He, it was his karma coming back. And that is what Barbara was feeling. She was feeling like, this is your karma for treating me like shit. This is your karma for cheating on me and leaving me with our child while you go out and do God knows what with, with whom. Okay, so there's a lot, a lot of anger, a lot, a lot of secrets, a lot. Um, but Barbara's coming strong in these group of cards here. And she put the idea in Bobby's head. Okay, she knew that he was in love with her, the King of Cups. He's the King of Cups, overwhelming in love. Not even, not just in love with her, in love with Sam's life. Period. Like, I don't, it's, that's what it feels like. Like somebody's being overly in love, love everything about somebody else's life. Um, even his wife, his clothes, his car, his career, his music, all of it. All right. So this is what I'm feeling. That's why the King of Cups is here for Bobby. Okay. Man, this, this is just crazy right here. This is just, oh, all right, Spirit and Sam, what else we need to know? What else we need to know? about the setup Bobby and Barbara all right so two cards fell out so I'm gonna go with that judgment justice secrets oh yeah queen of cups oh when a man, a woman's energy is super strong, super strong, super strong, man. I don't like how these cards looking. Barbara, man, played a bigger part than expected, y'all. I'm thinking it's Bobby. No, it's Barbara. It's Barbara. Barbara, both of them is in it, but Barbara had a, a, a very huge role. She is the one who, oh my God. Oh my God, we got the judgment card here. And Barbara, Barbara got tired of the secrets, y'all. We got moons all over, moon, 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 moon in this card, okay? So from what I'm getting from these cards, Barbara wanted out of the relationship, um, but she knew she, she didn't want to do it legally. I don't know if she felt like she was losing money um, or for some reason. But she wanted to have her own justice. That's why you have the justice card. She wanted to put, <laughs> put justice in her own hands. She was super tired. Justice and the judgment card, like I said, is vengeful. These two cards together to me tells me, speaking of someone who's vengeful someone who is like wanting to make somebody pay for pissing them off and making them angry and treating them like shit that's what i'm feeling like the energy from barbara at that time she's the judgment she's like i'm going to make you fucking pay you are going to pay for how you fucking treated me i'm tired of it i am going to take the law into my own hands okay the moon card, deception. We got the, look, of course, the three of swords is going to be here. Then we got the queen of cups. This speaks all Barbara, y'all. This is Barbara. She got tired of the cheating and, 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 and the, the lies and all of that. She loved him. And then the, the hurt turned to anger. And then it turned to wanting this man out of the picture, okay? She used Bobby to do it. That's what I'm getting. This is the page of pentacles. This is Bobby, okay? This was a student. This represents a student. He was Sam's student. He was the protege. He was like learning and, 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 and you know, he was learning from Sam. He was a student of Sam's. So this is, oh my freaking God. The Hierophant, this represents marriage, uh, religion, all of that, you know, but this represents their marriage. So, yes, this was, y'all, these cards don't play, y'all. These cards don't play. This is crazy. All of this is pointing to Barbara having a real big part in Sam's death. All out of vengefulness and anger and hurt and pain from how he treated her. 
okay? And she used Bobby the Page of Pentacles to to do it, okay? This is, man, if this is mind-blowing. This is mind-blowing. This is mind-blowing. I'm going to ask another question. Um, I want to ask about the, um, whatchamacallit? Ah, uh, I have a brain fog. Okay, you guys, so when Bobby Womack married Barbara, Sam's brothers, all of them was furious. So I want to know, did they suspect that Barbara had something to do with it? Barbara and Bobby had something to do with Sam's death? Did they know? Or did anyone else suspect Bobby and Barbara? All right, let's see. Did they suspect them to? And I'm like, if they did suspect it, they should have went to the authorities, man. They should have just went to the authorities. Uh, let's see. Did they suspect Bobby, Womack, and Barbara of having something to do with Sam's death? All right, let's see what else. They suspected the wife for a fact. They suspected it. They suspected it. Yep. Yes, they suspected it. I don't know why nobody went came forward though. They suspected Bobby and um Barbara. You could tell from the cards. You see the conflict? The conflict. That is probably what the fight came came about. Because you remember I said um that they did fight Bobby they, like they jumped him um if you guys don't know that um read up on it they did go after Bobby they beat the hell out of him and I think they felt it was if, if Barbara had something to do with it it was Bobby's uh influence but it was not Bobby's influence it was Barbara's influence okay um so it was definitely a setup they wanted him gone they knew that in their heart, in their intuition, in their gut, that it was not right. And they, they did feel that Barbara and Bobby had something to do with Sam's death. And nobody spoke up, though. Nobody spoke up, though. It was all for money. They were in love. You got the lover's card. They wanted him gone. And I'm just, I just wish more people would have spoke up for Sam. Nobody did. I just, that's my opinion. I just feel like nobody did their part really to really find out what happened to him. They just went with the verdict, seemed like. Like, where was the fight for this man? Where was the fight? Why y'all didn't just say, okay, I think you could need to look into Bobby or I think you need to look into Barbara. I mean, you know, something instead of going along with everything and them having a trial and not everybody being arrested and responsible or held responsible for his death okay so from these cards yeah they knew they knew they knew from in their heart they knew in their heart that bobby and barbara had something to do with this okay this is what i'm gonna ask oh, why did bobby womack not only marry barbara but why did he start sleeping with sam's and barbara's daughter why did bobby womack start start to sleep with sam's daughter and yes he was molesting her that perverted bastard he was molesting her she was a child spirit is saying she was a child why did he do this why did he do this why car came up sun car came up again that represents um the daughter why why did he do this
Why did he do it? You sick pervert. Why wasn't this man in jail? Like, when everybody found out he was sleeping with the daughter, why nobody put this man in jail? Like, what is wrong with these people? Like, nobody say nothing? Oh, that card's dropped, y'all. Hold on. <sighs> All right, this car was on the floor. It flew to the floor, so. Why? All right, three more cards. Okay, so we have the sun, we have the tower, and we have the ace of wands. He took advantage of his relationship with the daughter. Okay, um, he's supposed to have been a father figure to her, but then he used that from the beginning. This man is sick. Bobby Womack is a sick individual. I think he's dead. And to be honest, like, look, he's a person that presents don't even need to be here. And I'm just being honest. Okay, um, he doesn't. And that's why his life was chaotic after all of this. You don't do nothing sick and devious like this and you think you're going to have the best life. No, you're not going to have the best life. You're going to pay for everything that you've done to people. You are involved in a murder and a molestation of this man's child. You think his spirit is going to let you off easy? That's not going to happen. Sam is not going to let that happen. And that's why your life was shit afterwards. So, uh, let me get back to the reading. So, he took advantage of this girl's innocence, her looking to him as a father figure, okay? That's why you have the sun, the tower, and the wands, okay? Um, at some point, him and Barbara's relationship started to have cracks in it, and then instead of shifting it to work it out with his wife, or hell, another grown woman, he shifted his attention to the daughter, Okay? He was juggling. He's a hoe. He, and he was no better than, than Sam. He was a juggler. He was a hoe. Two of pentacles. This is him juggling uh, women. Him juggling women. 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 Three of cups. Him juggling. Partying. Women. 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 Her bro wanted Sam out the picture and she turned around and married somebody ten times worse than Sam. Had her depressed, crazy, gone, just, just miserable miserable but that was their karma that was her karma for having her husband set up to be killed her dealing and messing with his protege her doing all this shit out of vengeance and because she mad and not only did you do that you put your daughter in a situation to be in in the presence of a fucking molester a predator a predator this is what these cards are saying to me Yes, he did it. And it's because he was a hoe. He was he was horrible, just a horrible individual. He shifted his attention from Barbara to the daughter. As soon as she started developing as a young woman, he wanted her. As soon as he started seeing her sprout as a woman, he wanted her. And you know, a lot of us, you know, especially black women, we tend to bloom early. We start getting breasts, we start, our hips start spreading, our butts start getting bigger at seven, eight, nine years old. Okay? So, I wouldn't be surprised she was that young when he started looking at her. Like saying, oh, you're going to turn out to be a beautiful young woman. Oh, you're going to be this, you're going to be that. I'm not surprised he even said some stuff like that to her. The page of wands. You see? That's somebody talking shit, saying the right things. Come over here. So that's what he was doing, feeding her, telling her, oh, you're beautiful all the time, you know. I, I love you. You're beautiful. You're gorgeous. You deserve to be treated. Don't never let no man treat you a certain way. Let me show you how you suck. You should let a man treat you when you grow up and when you get older. Let me do this and that. You know, she's a kid. She don't know no better. She doesn't know any better. And he took advantage of that, okay? So, yes, this happened. This happened. And the reason for it was he was just a dog, a, a, a predator, and just a monster. And Barbara put this on her child. I'm sorry. She, she made this. This is the recipe for disaster. You're not going to sit up there and do something so devious. And then you think your life is going to be better. When you do stuff like that, you need to think about how it's going to affect your children. Okay? 
This man was a complete monster, a complete monster. You let him into your home. You let him in, 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 into your daughter's life. Okay? So, <sighs> I hope this sums it up. This is short and sweet. I didn't want it to be long. But that's basically it. Yes, 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 yes. Bobby and Barbara was involved in it. Um... And that's that. What can we do about it now? Nothing. Okay? We can't do anything about it now. I think everybody that was involved is now passed on. Um, the case is closed. You know, we can't try. Um, I don't think you can try the case again. I don't know. I hope on the other side, Sam got his justice from Bobby. That's all I'm saying. I hope when he crossed over, when Bobby crossed over, Sam was waiting for him. Because he deserved whatever Sam gave him when he crossed on the other side. He deserved it. And no, everybody thinking that when somebody passed away, their mind is different. No, your mind is the same. So if you were angry at that person and they crossed over and you see you on the other side, that anger is still going to be there. That resentment is still going to be there. Everything you feel... Or felt while you was alive, you're going to feel those same same feelings on the other side. Okay, so I hope this reading gave more clarification into who did it and why and why they are just horrible. They're horrible individuals, and they got their karma. And unfortunately, the daughter had to pay. The daughter had to pay for the mother's and Bobby's actions okay um i think the daughter actually wind up marrying bobby's brother this you know the whole situation is just crazy to me why bobby never went to jail lord i don't even know uh but anywho uh, thank you guys for tuning in if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do i would love to have you in the magic tribe also um my decks are available to purchase the shadow oracle deck the love and attraction oracle and the under construction oracle decks are uh, available to purchase thank you guys for tuning in i love you guys so much um Read up on this case. Read up on Sam Cooke. Read up on Bobby Womack. You can easily find out a lot of these things. It is public knowledge um, about his relationship with Barbara, the daughter, and all of that. But our main focus today was to find out if he was involved with Sam's death. It was him and Barbara. All right, you guys. I love you all. And until next video, peace and blessings.